thank you for joining us here in Glastonbury. We're at Mary Magdalene Wellness, near Luana. Today we're going to do a ceremony for the mothers, for Mother's Day. We're honouring the mother and daughters, grandmothers, sisters, and especially in this time where we've all had to pull together and get into our warrior zone and get through and getting the children back to school and this week's been quite hectic with our mothers, so well done everybody. So today we're going to honour from the Mary line in Glastonbury, this is a sacred place, so I hope you enjoy. Yay, blessings and I send all my love and gratitude to all the mothers out there, to the grandmothers and to the daughters. Um, for me, it's a very special time where I get to honor my mother who's now in spirit and also the Divine Mother, who, which both of them have always looked after me really well. So I'm really grateful for this opportunity to be here on the Mary Line today um, and doing this little meditation and, and putting our prayers here where everything is amplified and it's sent out to the whole world. So um, we invite you to just tune in into our space here on the, from the Magdalene Wellness Center. So we are here now, we've prepared the altar, we've prepared the space. Um, and if you just want to tune in to the energies of the Mary line, of this beautiful holding um, mother line of the land, of the land of Avalon, and, and into the space where you can just send your intentions and send your prayers and send your love to be carried through this, this special place that we are here working with. And so if we're going to begin now, so if you're ready to begin, um, if you are sitting down, we're just going to start by gently just kind of becoming more present into our bodies and becoming more present into the space where you are so that you can so we can all um, share the same experience from this from what we are sending to you through here so if you just if you're sitting down just slowly and gently just observing your breath just feeling your breath just trying to relax, relaxing your shoulders, just feeling your breath traveling throughout your whole body, bringing you to a relaxed state. So now placing one hand in your heart and a hand in your womb, and again taking deep slow breaths, just feeling yourself connected, connected to your higher power, to your guidance, to your spirit guides, and to this divine guidance that we are here to receive as well. So yeah, just feeling yourself centered, and now... <coughs> From your womb space, if you just allow a thread from your womb to travel down, down through your legs, through the soles of your feet, down into the earth, allowing that thread from your womb connecting to the womb of Gaia connecting to the womb of Mother Earth, allowing her to hold you there, to hold you in her space, allowing you to feel grounded, supported, nurtured and loved. Just feeling that connection between your womb and the womb of Mother Earth. few deep breaths, allowing now that energy to travel up, traveling back up, back into your womb area, 
feeling that deep connection and feeling that support. Now, when your next inhale and exhale, allow that room energy to travel to your heart, connecting the two, feeling connected, feeling your room and heart space connected. Allowing that energy to hold you and to support you. And now from your heart space on your next exhale, allowing that energy to travel up through the top of your head and your crown chakra, connecting to Father Sky, connecting to the heavens of Mother Mary. Allowing that energy, that star energy, to bring you wisdom, to hold and support you with divine guidance. Allowing that divine cosmic energy to hold you. As you breathe in and out, allow both energies to mingle into your heart and soul, into your heart and womb. Just holding those two energies together now in your body, in yourself. And if you're ready, I will take you on a little journey to honor your mother line, to honor your mother, whether she's alive or in spirit. To honor your grandmother and your children if you are a mother yourself. So we're gonna I, I will bring in now I'll bring you I bring it to you the rose. You just imagine now if you sit with a rose, a beautiful big rose on your womb space. Just hold a beautiful rose, whichever color that you want. Each color will be unique to you. It is your color. It is your individual connection to the rose. Allowing that energy of the rose in your womb area to expand. Feeling the petals and this beautiful flower to open and expand within you. And now from that same space, from this beautiful space in yourself, you see a fire. You see yourself standing by a fire, a big bonfire, a fire with dancing flames, a fire as bright as the sun rays. And now, standing by this fire, you invite your mother to join you. Ask your mother to join you, to stand next to you. And you ask your grandmother to join you and all the mothers in your mother line and all the matriarchs to join you and create a circle around this fire together this lineage circles around this fire and you may dance, or you may just stare at this fire as it may bring messages to you. And now you're all holding hands in a circle. You turn to your mother and you place your hand, one hand in her womb and one hand in her heart and 
Now is when you can say anything for, that you wish to say to your mother. May it be giving gratitude, may it be clearing any past sorrows or troubles. Just holding your mother in her heart and her womb. Feeling that deep connection between the two of you and all those other women from your line that surrounds you. Allowing that connection to grow, to expand, and to see what rises for you. Notice any emotions, any feelings. Notice even what you are wearing, what your ancestors are wearing. And now you bring in your grandmother and you together with your mother you place both your hands in her womb and her heart also allowing anything to clear and allowing any love to be shared and this will continue around the circle as the women in your line they greet and hold each other keeping that connection between the heart and the womb Once you see each woman in your circle feeling that connection and being held by this beautiful chain of love and support and acknowledgement and gratitude. Now you see yourself in joy around this fire. If you allow yourself for anything to, any emotions or anything that may arise for you that may be needed to be thrown into the fire. And I will now hold this flame, this candle, as you visualize anything, or as you see anything that arises within you that needs to be transformed and transmuted. Allow all the pain and suffering that your mother line may be carrying, may be holding, or maybe have even passed on to you. Allow these energies now to be transformed and transmuted. Allow these energies to be surrendered into the fire as everything now becomes new and transformed. As you now have transformed and cleared any negative patterns from your mother line and from the wounds of your grandmothers You, you feel a sense of relief as you stand by this fire. Allow yourself to move if you're feeling like dancing or allow yourself to simply take in the light energy of this fire. And as you are all standing, surrounding this fire in a circle, 
you now feel a presence you feel the presence of someone coming close to you and this and here comes Mother Mary Mary Magdalene and Sarah Kalitama the three of them they come and stand by your side and they may place a hand on your shoulder or they may embrace you to show you that they are there holding you and acknowledging your beautiful mother line as we all are connected to the great divine cosmic womb of the great divine mother so mother mary Mar mary madeleine and sarah kalitama they now hold you your mother and your grandmother just allowing yourself to feel that love and that holding and Mary Magdalene comes in front of you and she anoints you in your womb and as she anoints you your whole mother line benefits from this anointing as they all get anointed too And now allowing Mary Magdalene to anoint your womb. And Mother Mary comes now standing in front of you. And she places her hand in your heart. reminding you that you are also the daughter as well as the mother as well as the grandchild and the grandmother Sarah Kalitama brings you hope brings you joy you the beautiful shining ray of the sunshine into 
to your eyes. Now breathe in that light and allow that light through your third eye to sink into your body through your heart chakra and your womb. Now feeling held and supported by this beautiful circle and by this beautiful divine presence. You give your gratitude. You view your gratitude to yourself, to your mother, but to your mother, to your grandmother, giving gratitude to all those present. Do you want to play the drum? And uh, I'm, I'm your song. Really so I'm, I just want to do a, a, a song, a chant from a local um, singer here in Avalon. This is a song by Sally Pullinger. put on the very line here and just get in touch and, and, and we'll put it we'll 
bring your prayers here into the space for you as well. So I hope you enjoyed that. And thank you. I'll leave you with my love and gratitude. Blessings. And thank you. Happy for Mother's joining. Day. Happy Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. Thank you for joining us. Hopefully we'll be open soon. Yeah. And we'll see you all very soon. Thank you.